Dr. Eric Potter from Sanctuary Functional Medicine, where we help patients live healthier, more abundant lives with an intensive functional medicine approach to treat the root cause of your chronic illness. So we have been answering questions about mold toxicity. We did a whole Facebook Live on it uh, last week uh, or two, and we are going to be doing another Facebook Live on another topic coming up soon. Uh, but for right now, I'm going to answer another question uh, that Becky left. Are there good resources online to determine which remediation products are effective for mold but safe for people who are chemically sensitive? And microbials are popular, but not safe for her. So thank you for that question, Becky. Uh, what I'd like to say is there's not real good resources that are not uh, biased out there. Every company says their product is the best and the safest. Uh, there are... Uh, Jill Carnahan has a site where she has some uh, summaries of things, but there really is no place. Hers is not complete, though she calls it the definitive. So one of the things I hope to do soon is put together something where we look at those products uh, and do as much comparison as we can. Uh, it's a difficult thing uh, without having those products testing and uh, would be a very expensive process but we are wanting to at least get as much information out there for our patients and for our viewers uh, that will help them uh, have healthier lives away from mold so i look forward to seeing you at our next facebook live uh, have a blessed day